The man accused of opening fire at a Planned Parenthood clinic in Colorado Springs made his first court appearance today. 57-year-old Robert Lewis Deer appeared before a judge in a video hearing. Deer, accused of killing a police officer and two civilians, an Iraq war veteran and a mother of two who were accompanying separate friends to the clinic. The rampage off, touched off an hours-long standoff and shootout Friday that also left nine other people in the hospital. Now, Robert Lewis Deer also has ties to the Low Country, living in Walterboro until about the mid-2000s. News 2's Macy McLeod went to his old neighborhood today and found some people who knew him. Macy? That's right, Brendan. I spoke to four different people who knew Deer. They told me they were surprised Deer would be involved in something like the Planned Parenthood shooting. They all said he made them uneasy. I spoke to a few of Robert Deere's former Walterboro neighbors. They all say he didn't talk to them much. He didn't associate with the neighbors very much, so he just kind of kept to himself over there. He was not a good neighbor. That was it. We did not associate with him, so I don't know him. According to incident reports from the Colleton County Sheriff's Office, Douglas Moore accused Deere of shooting his dog with a pellet gun back in 2003. Deer was arrested for animal cruelty. That was in the past years ago. Okay. We have nothing uh, against the man. Just get out of here. As we walked away, Moore told us Deer has, quote, sealed his own fate. Other neighbors called Deer nuts, paranoid, and say he seemed off and made them uncomfortable. Another neighbor, John Hood, purchased some property from Deer and also says Deer was interested in buying his truck. He says he never expected Deer to become violent, but it was apparent he was anti government. Yeah, I didn't think he'd go to that extreme or something like that. I, he talked about the government quite a bit when we did talk. Like when my, he was trying to buy my truck. He was trying to tell me I should redo my roof on my house in, in metal, you know, metal roofing. I said, why should I do that? And he said, well, it keeps the, their spy satellites from looking through your roof. And right then I'm kind of going, okay. <laughs> He might not all be here. Neighbors told me the last they heard from Deer was when he was moving away from Walterboro to North Carolina. While Deer lived in Walterboro, he was arrested for animal cruelty and allegations of being a peeping Tom. He was convicted of neither charge. Deputies also arrived at his home in 1997 on a domestic violence call from his wife at the time. However, she did not want to file any charges. Macy McLeod, News 2.